I started to draw in museum, I think, as I was a, st a student in an art school. But it took a long time for me to understand that I needed constantly to draw in museums. I was visiting one floor before uh, I started to draw. And it does not mean I, I, I am so conscious when I make a tour. It's more I am already like an animal or getting in a trance. And I, I move, but it's more feeling. I follow some words that are speaking to my, let's say, unconsciousness. And after when I start, then I am somewhere else. I don't know what happens. It's highly precise what I have with me. It looks like chaos when I use that, maybe, and uh, dirty. But it's highly precise. I can draw without seeing if I, if I need, you know. And I try to bring myself into this mood. Uh, I go like deep in the picture, but uh, it, it's like when you dream, you know. Like everything is moving. And I, st I try to be inside this space. It's more, it gets everything fluid. And if the artwork come into you and you go outside of your body, like, you know, it has nothing to do with consciousness. I'm somewhere else. <laughs> and sometimes I'm, I am back in my body. And I think if I was outside of my body, I was in the artwork or getting, being the artwork for some seconds and bringing back, you know. It's like a traveling outside. I don't need to take any drugs or alcohol, I, I draw, you know. <laughs>